Welcome to the video. In this video, I will discuss the causes, symptoms, treatment and prevention of malaria. What is malaria? Malaria is a serious disease that spreads when an infected mosquito bites a human. Tiny parasites can infect mosquitoes. When it bites, the mosquito injects malaria parasites Plasmodium vivax into the person's bloodstream. If it isn't treated, malaria can cause severe health problems such as seizures, brain damage, trouble breathing, organ failure and death. How common is malaria? Malaria is common in tropical areas where it's hot and humid. Worldwide, more than 220 million people get malaria annually. The majority of these cases occur in Africa and South Asia. Around 450,000 people die from the disease every year. Where does malaria usually occur? Malaria occurs all over the world. It's common in developing countries and areas with warm temperatures and high humidity, including Africa, Central and South America, Dominican Republic, Haiti and other areas in the Caribbean, Eastern Europe, South Asia, islands in the Central and South Pacific Ocean, Oceania. The symptoms and causes. What causes malaria? People get malaria when an plasmodium infected mosquito bites them. A mosquito becomes infected by biting someone who has malaria. The infected mosquito transfers a parasite into a person's bloodstream, where the parasites multiply. Five types of malaria parasites can infect. Five types of malaria parasites can infect humans. What are the symptoms of malaria? Malaria symptoms usually appear 10 days to one month after the person was infected. Symptoms can be mild. Some people don't feel sick for up to a year after the mosquito bite. Parasites can live in the body for several years without causing symptoms. Signs of malaria are similar to flu symptoms. They include fever and sweating, chills that shake the whole body, headache and muscle aches, fatigue, chest pain, breathing problems and cough, diarrhea, nausea and vomiting. As malaria progresses, it can cause anemia and jaundice, yellowing of the skin and whites of the eyes. Diagnosis and tests. How is malaria diagnosed? To confirm a malaria diagnosis, your provider will take a sample of your blood and send it to a lab to check for malaria parasites. The blood test will indicate whether or not you have malaria and will also identify the type of parasite that's causing your symptoms. This information helps your provider determine the right treatment. Management and treatment. How is malaria treated? Treatment for malaria should start as soon as possible. To treat malaria, your provider will prescribe drugs to kill the malaria parasite. Some parasites are resistant to malaria drugs. The type of medication and length of treatment depend on which parasite is causing your symptoms. Anti-malarial drugs include artemisinin drugs, artemether and artisunate, atavacrone, chloroquine, doxycycline, mefloquine, quinine. Prevention. Can I prevent malaria? If you live or travel in an area where malaria is common, talk to your provider about taking medications to prevent malaria. You will need to take the drugs before, during and after your stay. You should also take precautions to avoid mosquito bites. To lower your chances of getting malaria, you should apply mosquito repellent with DEET, diethyltolumide, to exposed skin. Drape mosquito netting over beds. Put screens on windows and doors. Treat clothing, mosquito nets, tents, sleeping bags and other fabrics with an insect repellent called permethrin. Wear long pants and long sleeves to cover your skin. Thanks for watching. Hello. Welcome to the video. In this video, I will discuss the causes, symptoms,